neuf à la banque. I need carte. another thousand. I admire your courage, Miss... Uh... Trench. Sylvia Trench. I admire your luck, Mr... Like you to get me. It's an idea at that. Does toppling mean anything to you? A little. It's throwing the gyroscopic controls of a guided missile off balance with a, a radial beam or something, isn't it? More or less. The mango tree, my honey and me. Who is that? They said he must have been drowned. But he was far too good a diver for that to happen to him. And didn't the police investigate? And what about your family? I haven't got any family. There was only my father and me. You mean you're here all alone? Or have you any idea where he found them? No, he, he didn't say it. Crab Key, perhaps? Definitely not. Why so certain? Not geologically possible. Thank you very much indeed, Professor. It's very kind of you to spare me so much of your time. Oh, there was something wrong about this place. That was a machine gun, not a dragon. Oh, there's a dragon here, too. She's right. You've seen it, hmm? Yes, I have. He had two great glaring eyes, short tail and pointed wings. He was breathing fire. You don't believe me, do you? Little gal, I does. I tell you, Mr. Bound, let's get the hell out of here. Listen, both of you. There are no such things as dragons. What you saw was something that looked like one. Now I'm trying to think what it was. You persist in trying to provoke me, Mr. Bond. I could have had you killed in the swamp. And why didn't you? I thought you less stupid. You cost me time, money, effort. You damaged my organization and my pride. I was curious to see what kind of a man you were. I thought there might even be a place for you with Spectre. Well, I'm flattered. I prefer the revenge department. Of course, my first job would be finding the man who killed Strangways and Quarrel. Unfortunately, I misjudged you. You are just a stupid policeman. Underneath. 